everybody. Okay, so today is another weekend adventure. I've got Spencer in the car, and we are heading to Ocala National Forest for Memorial Day weekend. I've never been here before, so I'm not really sure what to expect. It looks pretty cool from the pictures and stuff I've seen, like from what I've Googled, and I think it's gonna be a fun little adventure. They have a lot of um, like historic places, I guess, there, so we'll just go wander and check it out, and it should be fun, so let's go. found one of those kitschy roadside attractions and I have to check it out. It's called Indian River Fruit. Uh, I don't know. I mean, they've got random things here. Ow. Okay. So, um, it's pretty weird. Let's check it out. It's honestly the craziest collection of just random yard art. This place is huge. It just keeps going. never seen so much random artwork and then they've got like old vintage signs and old sodas and like a fruit stand Navy bombing range. Do not enter. How cool is that? Live bombing exercises may be in progress. Danger. Oh, sorry. Danger. Unexploded ordinance. Okay, so we're driving along. Look at this sign. Danger. Laser range in use. Invisible radiation. Do not enter. That's crazy. There's signs all along this road too. That one says unexploded bombs. This is so crazy. I feel like we shouldn't even be over here. I wonder what it looks like on the other side of these trees. We made it to the Ocala National Forest Visitor Center, but it's closed. Uh, it's the Pittman residence. It was built in 1938 and it looks like an old camp cabin. Like I just think it is so cute. I wish that we could go in though. Sucks that it's closed. Yeah, it's adorable that the visitor center is this old camp cabin. I think that's awesome. And then they've got these other houses over here and then uh, it looks like RV camping and a trail. Look at the moss growing up on this roof over here. This is crazy looking. It's one of the back houses of the visitor center, which is right over there. But there's like moss all over the roof of the building. You are here. So we're here, at, we're here at the visitor center. Over here is the bombing range where we were earlier. I had no idea that there was a bombing range in the middle of Ocala National Forest. Looks like someone shot at it. Anyways, um, this is the map of Ocala National Forest. It's huge. It's actually really crowded today because of the holiday weekend. So we can't get into any of the springs, which is a total letdown but we will be exploring more of this because it looks like there's quite a few and Silver Springs was the one that we were at earlier but um there's tons to do here hiking camping um, I do want to go snorkeling here later this summer so yeah I mean this is a really cool area and I'm having a lot of fun just being out in the woods and like the wilderness like you can hear the cars going by now because we're like off the beaten track but we're like back on the main road where the visitor center is kind of towards the entrance of the national park but this is really cool and i definitely want to explore more of this 